Welcome to lesson 12. In this lesson we're going to learn a new technique exercise called grid diddles. We'll learn how to count half note rolls in quarter time, review quarter note rolls in eight time, and learn the first two strokes of a new flam rudiment called the flamacue. Before we get started, go through on my soapbox here and remind you that you need to be practicing your technique exercises and rudiments every single day. We're going to test these in graduation test section three, so if you haven't been practicing those every day, you're not going to be up to par when we get to that point. Check the lesson progress chart in the back of the book for the tempos we require at this point. All right, this new exercise is called grid diddles, and Sounds kind of funny, but essentially it's a concept that you can apply a lot of techniques to and make a ton of different exercise. The grid concept simply is that I take four notes, in this case eighth notes, and apply a technique to that four note grid. In this exercise, I'm applying diddles to the grid. First uh, couple of measures, I put a diddle on the first note of the grid, then the second note of the grid. I move the diddle to the third, to the fourth, then I do one and three, two and four. So I can do all kinds of techniques and apply it to the grid concept. Accents, I can do diddles, I can do drags, I can do rolls, I can do flams. So the sky's the limit in how many exercises you can create by using the grid. In this exercise, what I'm going to do is break it down into two different techniques. The first is using a double stroke. So I'm going to take a slow enough tempo and play with my sticks on my leg. So essentially what I'm looking for is something like this. Doing a nice relaxed double stroke. Go through each of those four measure exercises applying the nice relaxed double stroke with playing your sticks on your leg. You can also do it with your sticks on a pillow or if you're watching TV and you're on the couch you can play with your hands on your stomach. <laughs> Definitely no padding there. Then I'm going to take another technique which is the double bounce and apply it to the same exercise. This one, I'm going to move the metronome up to about 140 beats per minute, and I'm going to bounce the stick rather than play double strokes. So a double stroke on the last two uh, on the last line would look like this, where my stick is actually hitting twice. A double bounce is where my hand motion hits once, but then I allow the stick to bounce. Here's what the last line will look like using a double bounce. You can look at my hands and, and really be able to tell that I'm not struggling to play a double stroke. I'm allowing the stick to bounce. So go through each of those exercises within the grid and isolate maybe just one count. And get used to applying the double bounce to that technique as well. In our next video lesson, you're going to learn how to count half note rolls in quarter time.